Hey everyone, here are five easy weight loss meals that are super quick and affordable. So today I have for you all some easy weight loss meals and more importantly, they're healthy weight loss meals. Yes, that's right. I don't promote any fad diets or crash diets in here. Now, let's get on with it. Now, these meals aren't just any random meals either. I've actually organized it so you're having a full day's worth of food here, making it super helpful for you. Starting with breakfast. So for this meal, you'll need some oats, dried cranberries, goju berries, some pumpkin seeds, and cinnamon. Firstly, start by adding the oats to the bowl. Next, add in your cranberries, goju berries, and pumpkin seeds. And once you've done that, it will look like this, and it's now ready to add a small amount of water to. After that, add a drop of milk, then sprinkle on your cinnamon. Finally, pop it in the microwave for two minutes, give it a good stir, then enjoy. For lunch, we have tuna pasta mayo. So for this meal, you'll only need a tin of tuna, light mayonnaise, whole wheat or grain pasta, some sweet corn, and sea salt and black pepper, although these two are optional. Now to make this, simply boil the pasta, and in the meantime, begin to mash up your tuna into flakes. Once you've done that, you can now add in your salt and pepper. The next thing to do is add in your mayo and give it a good mix. Then, you'll need to put in the sweet corn and mix it up again, add in a little more mayo if needed. After that, drop the pasta in, give it a final mix, and that's it. Now, with three more extra ingredients, if you fancy something a little different, you can easily make a pasta bake with this. All you'll need is some grated cheese, oregano, and basil. So start by putting the ready-made food into an oven-proof dish. Add as much or as little basil and oregano as you want and mix it up. Then you need to dash a bit more mayo and then spread the cheese to cover. Once it looks like this, I add a pinch of salt for taste and then you're ready to bake it. Bake it in the oven over a high heat until golden brown. Then dish it up and enjoy. After training, we have homemade protein shake. In order to save time on this video and to keep it brief, and not to mention the fact I've already done two videos on this, I've decided to just let you know that I'm going to be leaving a link to my homemade protein shake video in the description. Now there aren't a ton of ingredients for it and it's super easy and fast to make. Next up for dinner, sweet and spicy barbecue chicken. For this meal, you'll need a few ingredients, but don't worry, it's easy to make. Starting with the sauce, you'll need some garlic, two whole onions, some olive oil, a tin of chopped tomatoes, tomato puree, maple syrup, cayenne pepper, chili powder, paprika, cinnamon, salt and pepper, and some apple cider vinegar. Now to make this meal, we begin with the sauce. You'll need to start by chopping and dicing your garlic like I am here. Then, Chop your onions and dice them as big or as small as you want. Once you've done that, throw them in the pan and dash a tablespoon of olive oil in. Next, you'll want to add the whole tin of chopped tomatoes and then add two tablespoons of the tomato puree following by two tablespoons of maple syrup, a half tablespoon of cayenne and chili powder. After that, add two to three tablespoons of paprika, then a dash of cinnamon. Next, put as little or as much salt and pepper as you want, then a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. Once that's all in the pan, begin to heat it up and stir it regularly. Moving on, you'll need some chicken chicken breast. This can either be whole breast or strips like these. You'll need a green pepper and a red pepper and again some olive oil, salt and pepper. Firstly begin by chopping the peppers into chunks. After that dash some olive oil into a wok and let it heat up. Get some salt and pepper on the chicken strips then throw it in the heated wok. Flip this regularly trying not to burn it. After that Add in your peppers to soften. Once that's done, you can now add in your barbecue sauce. Finally, stir it up and keep it on a medium to low heat to simmer for about 10 to 20 minutes. Last, make sure your chicken is cooked properly by checking it's not got any pink in the middle. After that, you can enjoy your tasty, healthy dinner. And finally, before bed, we have a peanut butter rice cake. Yes, this one is exactly like butter and some bread. And you'll only need two ingredients, some plain rice cakes and some all natural peanut butter. Basically, just like I said, dip and spread easy. Okay, to sum this video up, porridge for breakfast, tuna for lunch, a super tasty homemade shake for after a workout, chicken for dinner and a rice cake and peanut butter before bed. So then, if you enjoyed this video, give us a like. Not only that, why not show your support for this channel by sharing it with your friends? And there you have it, five easy weight loss meals. If you want more videos from me, you can find them right there. Not only that, hit that subscribe button right up there.